This is one of the worst players in Dream League Soccer, but today I am going to be making him a World Cup legend. Right now, the record for the most goals ever scored in a single World Cup tournament belongs to Fontaine, who scored 13 goals in six matches. Pretty legendary if you ask me. But we're going to be making this 54 overall Sarah here an even bigger legend by breaking this record in Dream League Soccer's own version of the World Cup, the International Cup. But what will be a disadvantage is that I cannot use any legendary players up front with them. So we have Ladin and Traore up there with them instead. And before each game, I'm going to be spinning this wheel, which will decide which type of goals I'm only allowed to score with Sarah. So... Let's give it a spin and see what we get for our first game. What we, we, we have to score with only the B button. Okay, that seems pretty simple. We are off. We already have to start out by playing against the defending World Cup champions. So this might just be tough already. But hopefully we can get a little bit of goals here. Wow, he is so slow. And okay, that is just terrible. I know I'm playing against the CPU, but this challenge might be harder than I thought. All right, Triora into Sarah. Into Sarah. Boom. Okay. I just said it was going to be hard, but we scored our first goal. Ladin. And let's see that pass beautiful pass sarah with the shot wow okay well nice save sarah shoot a turnaround shot let's go we started off this challenge with a bang scoring two goals in the first 30 minutes but we only have a maximum of seven games to beat this challenge so i need to keep scoring well let's go sarah i know you're running out of stamina it is the 66 minute but okay we got a free kick maybe we can pass it to him and get a goal let's do one of these over to de bruyne and then one more time oh, okay now that was terribly executed all right let's see if i can find sarah in the middle to try all right oh 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 okay I, I, Sarah just doesn't want the ball. He's too tired. That is full time. We beat Argentina 2-0. So that's a pretty solid first game. That's exactly the amount of goals I needed to score. But I did want to get a little bit of a head start. Especially since I scored my first two goals in the first 25 minutes. But, you know, he has 54 overall. He's going to get tired. All right, Wheel, do your worst. What are you going to give me? Skill goals only. This one might be tough with a 54 overall player. But if he's going to be a World Cup legend, he has to score some skill goals. So let's try. All right, let's try it. Let's try it. Oh, yo, that was so close. Sarah's wide open. Let's rainbow early. Oh, oh, okay. Oh my gosh. Really? Really? Okay, let's try again. Uh, oh my gosh. That's another crossbar. I don't know. This guy has what it takes. No way. He has what it takes. What a goal. Let's show the rainbow. Let's show the rainbow and the rainbow volley. Okay. Oh my gosh. Well, we have scored one incredible skill goal in the first half. Can we make it two? We do have the average two goals if we want to beat this challenge. So I'm really hoping. I'm really hoping we can do it. All right. Let's do the rainbow over the defender. And then the volley. Boom. My man finally hit the net. He is slowly turning into a legend. But you know what would be even more legendary? If he did another one. Oh, okay. All right. Not, not a legend quite yet. All right, Ladin. Feed him another amazing ball. Okay, to Traore. Okay, and then... Oh! I think that's a skill goal. That's a Rabona. This dude is a complete legend. I haven't scored a Rabona in so long. That was an absolute shocker of a game. We got three skill goals from Sarah. Like I said, he is slowly becoming a legend. We have five goals only nine more to go. But the number of games I have left is slowly going down. So I still have to concentrate real hard and play really well. And we also have to get lucky with this wheel. What do we get? We get, ooh, we get normal goals. Okay, we'll see how this goes. Something tells me this is gonna go worse than the skill goals. But hey, we're, we're, well, let's just see. Well, since we can finally shoot with A, how's the long shots looking? Okay, not terrible, but probably not gonna score with that. Over to Sarah. A wide open path. Is he fast enough? Oh, okay, we got a chance. Not a goal though sarah volley oh i swear the when the goalie's just screened by all all these defenders the weakest shots just go in man okay that is our sixth goal sarah we're gonna try a turnaround shot man this is this is gonna be tough he's also losing stamina at a very very rapid pace okay here we go here we go here we go here we go with the shot ah okay but this is where we scored before varan let's get it over to pogba to get it over to sarah and then his shot oh come on pogba Pogba, over to Sarah. Wide open net. There we go. There is seven goals. The halfway point before the round of 16. Can we make it eight before the end of this game? Come on, Sarah. You know you want to. You know you want to. Okay, this is just... <laughs> Why do I try? But all of that is scaring me for an outside-the-box challenge because I don't know if I'm going to be able to score any. I mean, we can use this as practice if he wants the ball. My gosh. Well, we don't score another goal, but with that win, we have advanced to the round of 16. And yeah, games are going to get harder, but you know what? This guy is just becoming more of a legend, so it maybe it will be easier. We are up against Morocco in the round of 16. We need a win because we are far away 
from breaking this record, so come on, we have to play our best. But that'll all depend on what we get here. Come on, come on, and it is normal! Wow, that was this close to being set pieces, and honestly, I think I would be screwed. But right now, we need seven more goals with Sarah to break the record that Fotane set back in 1958. Crazy, come on, let's do it. Boom, boom, come on, give me an easy goal. First goal, let's go! Four minutes in. Oh no, oh no, oh wow, the post bails me out. Come on, give me this easy goal. Gotta get, gotta take the tappins. Gotta take the tap in sometimes. For the hat trick in the first half, let's go! Like I said, he's becoming a legend. That is our 10th goal. Uh, you know, I have a feeling this is gonna go like the first game and I'm gonna have a completely terrible second half, but maybe it'll be different. Well, what I thought is happening, but wait, but wait, there we go, wow! Like I said, this guy is becoming a legend. That's 11. Who knew the round of 16 against Morocco would be where Sarah shines, but here we go. And you know what? We got to keep the goals coming because we can get one of those set pieces challenges and it would screw over everything. That's 12. Unfortunately, we couldn't score any more, but we scored five goals. Sarah went on an absolute tear. That normal and the wheel completely blessed us. We only need two more goals to break the record. But if I am unable to score two goals and we lose in the quarterfinal, this challenge is over, I lose. So I still am worried. We never know. The wheel decides everything. What are we going to get? Give me something that I can do. And okay. Yep. They knew. It's set pieces only. This one might be an absolute killer because not only will I probably not be able to score as many goals with Sarah, I still have to win. So if I let in a goal, I'm screwed. Come on, foul me. You know you want to. You know you want to. Come on, I know it's the quarterfinal. Foul me. I'm so dangerous. Have the ball. He's just so dangerous. He's a legend. You have to foul him. Okay, this is just, this is just painful. This is what I feared. I need a goal in the second half. I can't let it end like this. Come on, give me a foul. You know you want to. Oh, okay, there we go. He touched the ball, but he knocked me off after, I guess. All right, 46 shooting, but he is a legend for the 13th goal of the World Cup. He jumps over the ball. Well, like I said, set pieces are hard to get, but I am glad we got our penalty, which means we tied the record and we only need one more goal in the semifinal. This is it. This next game will decide whether or not I made Sarah a World Cup legend. And you know what? It's a little bit fitting that this will likely be our last game because Fontaine originally broke this record in six games because back in 1958, well, there was no round of 16. So the maximum amount of games you could play was six. So here we go. Last game, probably. Let's see what we get in the wheel. Will it be easy for me to make Sarah a World Cup legend? Legend outside the box only. Yep, they're gonna make it hard for me. But here we go. England is a tough team to beat. Their team is pretty good. So here we go. As long as it's not draw nil-nil and I win in penalties, the wheel has decided I will break this record with a long shot or not break the record at all. Here we go. Come on, Sarah. There we go. This is what I need. This one. Oh my gosh. This is gonna be so hard, isn't it? But that's just the way the wheel universe works. They give me the hardest challenge when I need it the most. Come on, come on. Oh man, he just whiffed. There we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. Oh my gosh, this shoots right at him. What do I do? Come on, come on, float it in. There we go. I have to float it in. <laughs> that is 14 goals. Dario Serra beats the world record for most goals in a single World Cup, and he is now a World Cup legend i mean technically he's an international cup legend but this is basically the world cup it's the same format fontaine scored 13 goals in six world cup matches in the same tournament but sarah scored 14 in six matches and there's still one to go but there's no need he's already a world cup legend he's already broken the record he's just amazing if you enjoyed today's video leave a like subscribe to the channel thank you guys for watching i'll see you guys in the next one